Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Roxy and I am so excited to start doing tutorials for you guys. Today I am going to start my first tutorial on my eyebrows. I've had a lot of requests on Instagram regarding how I do my eyebrows. As you can see I already have one done and I'm going to show you guys how I accomplish my morning routine by showing you the right brow. Now, um, I just want to start by showing you what I'm going to be using in this tutorial and then I'm going to move on in showing you how I do it. Now, I'm going to be using a mascara wand, a angled brush by the number of 263, love this brush, a flat pointy brush that is the 195, these are MAC brushes by the way, and my all-time favorite, the 224, which is a blending brush. Now, the shadows that I like to use are espresso and soft brown. They're my favorites for my eyebrow. And this one right here is espresso, and soft brown is this one right here. Now, what I like to do as well is highlight my eyebrow and clean it up after I'm done filling them in. And what I use is the Studio Finish Concealer by MAC, and it looks like this. Now, this one's a darker shade than me. This is just something that I had in my kit. I actually have a sample of what I like to use, which is NW20 to highlight. Now, if I don't want to highlight, I use NW25. It gives, it matches my skin tone a little bit better, so it gives me more of the natural highlight underneath my brow. Now, all right, let's get started. So what I start doing is I comb my eyebrow upwards like this, and then I comb it in the direction that they grow. And you can see. Then I go in with my angle brush and I dip it in the espresso. Now what I like to do is I like to draw a line, see if I can see it, right underneath my brow line. And what I do is I just follow my natural growth because I like the way my eyebrows are shaped. All I'm doing is filling them in. Now some people do need to fill in a little bit more or shape them themselves. I um, like an arched brow so some people like to fill it in and make them arch. So I make them round. Mines are naturally arched. I just clean them up. And then I take the top and I fill them in. I don't start from the front on the top because that's where I go in with the soft brown. And I mix it in with the espresso to give it a much more softer look. I don't like my eyebrows looking really deep. I like my eyebrows looking more on the softer side. My hair is black. You can use a black shadow. It's based off of preference. Like I said, I just like a softer brow. So. That's why I go and blend it in with soft brown. Now, what I'm doing is I fill it in after I draw those two lines, but just halfway. And if you can see, it already looks darker towards the end. Then I uh, grab the soft brown, and this is where I'm going to go in, in here, and I'm going to buff it inwards. And then I do the same thing, and I buff it inwards. And if you feel like you go beyond your line, I always use my finger to wipe it off. I feel like skin on skin usually works like an eraser. But then I also go with my concealer and clean it up, so don't worry about it if it does get a little off. And then just shape them better with my concealer. So now as you can see, I'm going in the front. And I'm doing short strokes. Because I like to mimic the natural growth of the way my hair grows. So 
I feel like I get a more natural finish if I do shorter strokes like this. Now sometimes I lift my brow up because I feel like I don't get it in real good because my eyebrows are a little on the thicker side. And I don't want any holes. Okay. Looks good to me. And I like to buff out that line that I first did with the espresso, blending it in with the soft brown so that way you won't see that line. And then I go back in and I comb. And I like to extend my brows just a little. Okay. Now I'm going to take the 195 brush, which I love because it's cut into a point. So I feel like it's easier to get a perfect line and then buff it out because it's angled on the side. And I really don't use much. I feel like less is more. So I only put some on the tip. And then I make sure that I follow my line evenly because I don't want to mess this up. As you can see, I'm just following the um, shape of my brow, cleaning it up. Giving it that perfect sharp line. And then I go upwards and I clean it up. Now if there's any excess, you just wipe it off in a napkin, towel, whatever it is that you use. And this is where I go in with the side of the brush and I'm buffing it downwards. Because you want to make sure that you don't see it. That's the whole point. That it looks natural and that your eyebrow looks perfect. I love this concealer because it covers when those days that you don't have time to take those little hairs out and you're in a rush, it works miracles. It literally makes me look like I just got my eyebrows done because it hides the unwanted hairs. Okay, it's looking good. And then I wipe up this right here. And I blend it real good. Now I like to set it in with um, a shadow, your face powder. Uh, I'm going to use Orb today, which is a shadow. And that's where I go in with the 224. I like to use a blending brush because it buffs it really, really well. Where it just looks like it just is coming out naturally from the skin. It's not something that you just apply that's really thick. just in circular motion um, just buffing it out with orb which is a light color very light highlight color it's one of my favorite lid colors and I'm just gonna go and touch up the other brow and there you go that's how I get my brows done every morning um, I just want to tell you guys how excited I am to start sharing all these tutorials that I have so many in mind to do. I know that someone requested for me to do a wing liner, which I am going to be doing next. And then I will also be doing a bun that I got a request for me to do from a wedding that I went to with my husband. And I am super, super excited, and I know I keep saying this, to share so many things with you guys. So, Thank you for watching. I am going to be posting everything on Instagram every time I post a new tutorial and the link as well. So please comment, give me requests. I'll be more than happy to do anything you guys need me to do. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it works. And if you guys do try to do this, please post pictures, tag me, let me know how it went. If you need uh, me to do it again or do something different regarding the brows, I'll be more than happy to do it as well. Thank you guys. Bye.